Hey, this is Collected Dude. I'm out at Half Price Books. I wanted to check out and see what books they got. So I'm looking look through as many as I can. Maybe look through some other stuff. We'll see. Got some Iron Man, the eyes. But uh some of the books I find they're pretty cool. Some of them they collect comic books for years, but sometimes you miss stuff and you just hey I never saw that before. So we'll see what we can see. Hmm. It's a different cover there. Justice Machine. I met Mike Gustavich before. He was pretty cool years ago when he was working on just different books. I bought some artwork off of him. Everything really cool. Jonah Hicks. He had a whole bunch more in here earlier. I think people have picked through it. They had some early stuff. It was almost like a whole run of his books. Journey to Mystery Inc. I like the title, how they write his name. Let's see. The Writers of the Worm and such. Okay. Good night. Let's see if I can put this so they can fall a little better. JSA. A little it's thicker. There's two um, boards. I will turn out at work. Let's see. A George Brass cover. That's cool. Last ride, Legion of Superheroes. Cool. I haven't been picking up too much DC or any new books lately. I've been trying to pick up a lot of um, books from Half Price Books. I hit as many as I can to see what they got. And some of them you can get stuff. People just bought it and they'll sell it to Half Price Books like within a week or so. Or either it's from a comic book store or personal collector, I don't know. That's cool. I think I got this signed, I think. Remember. Oh, Justice. Four, five, six, seven. These are cool covers. Eight. Wow. Ten, twelve. Death Metal. Say just the United Europe. Let's see if I can get fall some more. It's almost too much. Okay, these are signed, looks like by cartoonist and writer. Five bucks. That's kind of cool. I think I'll pick these up. Five bucks? Yeah. That's 12, and this is one. Oh, no, 11. Oh, cool. Punchline. Looks like Margo. Robbie. Uh, there's some more. Okay. Seven and eight. These are signed as well. Cool. Katana. Oh, and this one's signed. Let's see if I can, like, hang on, I'll pick them all up. I like to read the story and see what it's about. Nights at the dinner table. This started off really good. I'm not sure where it's at now. 
because she got herself into a predicament. I was like, how in the world is she going to get out of that? He wrote it really good. Looks like all of them are in here. Some variants. Kilroy is here. Eternity. Okay. This is a good story. I have yet to go through all of it though. I wanted to see what was going to happen to him near the end. Or at the end. Oh, Iron Man. Blackluster. This is the first hammer. Is that a movie? Not a best selling novel. Okay. Only part. Passport Lethal Strike. Lock and Key. Lady Castle. Lost. Okay, Lords of Avalon. Lethal Strike again. Legion. Loveless. Legions. 44, I just wonder what this was about. Mm, Legion of Supergirls, okay. That's right. Alright. Supergirls, so that's what we we'll find. More day. That's different. What's that about? Is that number one or what? I'll put it aside. Oh, this is cool. Oh, rage. Put that aside. Minor threats, that's weird. Merlin. Rage. Manhunter. Number one for five dollars. Okay. Cool covers. I got all the detail. This one signed by Stan Lee. That's cool. Alex Ross. I got one of those at home, Alex Ross. Marvel. Is it Marvel? 1000. The Me You Love in the Dark. Midnight Nation. A Man Called Kev. Make sure I'm holding the camera right. Mind Management. Okay. That's a good order. No, what is this? Local publisher comic and record set. Oh, that's different. I'll put that aside. It's different. They're a little faster. It's kind of interesting. Nightmare log. 
Maybe, huh? It's a neon, neon Joe. Cool. Nexus. covers like that that's cool looks like Alex Ross how oh, he does his style Star number 81. By the time Alpha finds him, it'd be too late. Hmm. Doomsday Clock. I still have yet to read that. New Gods. The others. Outcast. I don't know what, don't know what happened to the TV show or a net. Or was it on Netflix or HBO or something? We're on the outcast, I'm not sure. I'm not sure if it'll take off or what will happen with it. It's just, when you deal with different stuff, that's it, the content of this book, the story and everything like that, it gets kind of weird whether you want to look at it or not. Sometimes I don't really like to watch horror stuff like that. But um, Walking Dead is not too bad. But, um... When you get into the other stuff like that, I, I usually don't watch watch too much of that. Power pack. That's kind of funny. Patty cake and friends. <laughs> Let's see what that is. I set that aside. It's kind of funny. Or it is funny. Punisher, pink lemonade, paradise. Pretty deadly. I remember the first couple of books of that were, were pretty good. I, um, the character, interesting. Paper Girls. I just saw the H porn uh, Netflix story. It wasn't too bad. I knew what it was about, so it wasn't. It got kind of boring. But Queen of what's that? Swords. Hmm. Burst from the pages of Barbaric. No busting, whatever. Okay, wild covers. Relay. Oh, that's pretty crazy. Wow. Red Hood Not Lost. See? I don't think green kryptonite ever has an effect on him. He's got the wrong thing. He's gonna get, he's about to get messed up. I wonder what happened in that book. It has to be blue kryptonite or something for um, Bizarro. Leave it in the comments below. What, what hurts Bizarro, I forgot. Green, it doesn't, it doesn't have the same effect. That's wild. Okay. Signed by a local artist. Red Sonia. 666. That's wild. Radio Gahana. Oh. That's cool. Academy Finals. Number one. Number two. 
I didn't read that story. I want to read that. Captain Satan. What in the world? Silver Surfer 141. That's cool. Quiet all this. I'll set it aside. Let's step into Sacrificers. Two or four. Shanna. Or Shanna. Savage Dragon. Silver Surfer is 69. Scorpion Core. Star Child. Sea Storm. Star Lord. Strange Adventures. Some of the books I, I look at, I'm thinking, you know what, I really don't want that. I'll pass on them, even if it's something that's kind of cool. Uh, I'm trying to very, be very selective. Watch how much, you know, you watch how much you spend. Because you can get in here and go, I want that, I want that, I want that, I want that. And you're like, oh my goodness. You get up to the register and like, what am I doing? <laughs> I've done that before. I go to the comic book store and say, I want that, I want that, I want that. Get up to the... You get up to the register and you kind of like, uh, and then you turn around and you go back and you and you try to put some stuff back, kind of sly, and you go back up and you have a much lighter pile of books in your hand or a stack of books in your hand than you had 15, 10 minutes earlier. It's like, oh, I changed my mind. I better not do that. Wow, walking in the house with a bag of a stack of books. Anyway, did you go to the grocery store like I asked? Huh? <laughs> like, I knew I forgot something. Yeah. Okay, Suicide Squad. Okay. What's this one? Genesis. That's different. I'm talking about one. That's cool. I like the Turner painting or whatever that is. Illustrator or something like that. I don't know. Photoshop. Siege. Shade. The Shade. Okay, Convergence. Seven Soldiers. Soldier Seven, I mean. Okay. Some stuff I picked up when it came out and everything. Some stuff you haven't seen in years. What's this one? Silver Comics number one. Enter Seabolt. <laughs> uh oh, don't have the hiccups, please. Oh, something's killing the children. What number is that? Number 19, I'll put it aside. I remember looking at that and seeing it going, oh, I don't like the cover, the name of that. That's kind of weird. I was looking at two different versions and two different covers of uh, number one when it first came out. And I'm like, uh, I don't think I'll get that. And man, when I found out it shot up the price and it was going to be a movie, I'm like, you got to be kidding me. Come on. Don't ever let the title of a a book or something like that get you like that anymore because you never know my one friend told me that he said there you never know he said if you see a number one of any image comic book pick it up because you never know it might get done into a movie and it'll go shoot up in price I'm like yeah you're right Star Lord Annual I mean not all of that you, you guys know but he said you never know what um, stuff's going to do, though. Jeff Smith. Okay. Sabretooth. He looked, wow, what in the world? Big hands. What in the world's going on with him? Okay. Okay. That's cool. Sword of Iboria. Shanghai Red. That started off pretty good. Savage Avengers. 
stainless steel wrap. Shanghai Red Street Jacket. Okay. Sable Fortune. These are some cool covers. We almost buy them for the covers. Straw Man. Oh, Spider Man. Cool. No, I didn't pick up any Spider-Man for a while. I might pick up some of these just to see. Read the story, I think. They're not too much. I like to pick up this just to read the story. That one. That's cool. That one. And I'll pick up these. Just don't want to read the story. And so that's all of those. Ooh, Star Wars. That's cool. Pick these up, Star Wars. We usually don't see a lot of Star Wars out here. I've been looking for the DC uh, variants with the, with the logo down in the bottom. Oh, that's cool, Superboy. I'm using superheroes for five dollars. Number two thirty. Okay, Adventures of Superman. Oh, come on, I'm trying to get on. I want to bend the books. But, um, Steel. It'd be cool if they came up with another Who should play Steel next time? That's cool. Let's see, Bizarro's World. Um, those are all cool covers with the die cuts. Off my world, he says. Uh oh. So you get off my world, get your feet off my desk. Okay. over here. Let's see what else we can get. Oh, turtles. That's cool. I like turtles. I remember when they first came out and it fell flat so I didn't get a dent. I've done it before. You get a really nice book and you drop it and it gets on the corner. You dent, dent the corner like that. And you're like, I just knocked off maybe 30, 20, 30 dollars off that, the price of that book <laughs> just by dropping it. Cool. I might pick up all of these. Depends on how many there are, though. Wow. Let's see. Titans, Titans. That's pretty crazy. This was a good story. Style. I'd love to see this as a movie. I got the first few issues of that. I think first and second printings of the first 10 or something. Because it started off pretty good. Look at this. Oh no, who is it? It's all signed by Raz. I'm not sure what that is. Hmm. Telos. Is that George Perez cover? Looks like, looks like a George Perez cover. Oh no, Nick Cordy. Task Force, this started off. The first book was good with that. King of the Thief, thief Thieves Thieves of Kings. This was going for a little bit of money at one time, I'm not sure what it's doing now. Truth and Justice, Titan. Let's see, I try to 
do 30 minutes of videos because these are pretty cool to go through these. And you can stop and watch the movie, watch the video a little later. That's weird. Trees. This was a good story. Different covers. Again, anime, anime style. That's cool. That one too, that's cool. I'll buy that just for the cover. This was a good story. I want to get that. I want to get these turtles. Alright, X Force. No. All these are the team up section. El Diablo. Okay. This is good. The artwork in the Frank Cho. Is a signed book over. I got a signed book of Frank Cho of his artwork in the artwork section. I didn't pick it up though. I'm not sure if I'm gonna get it or not. I like his art though. That's cool. I like the vamp. Volcrier. Vigil, Vigil. Vampire Slayer. Okay, boy trip. Lad. This is a local guy here, I think, too. Yeah. I was working with him for a little bit. The verdict. That's different. I'll grab that number one. Ooh, that's cool. What if versus issue three? The Adato cover is awesome. Okay, what's this? Five dollars for that one. Then, oh, that's kind of beat up. It's torn and everything. What if he, if he married the black cat? Wow. Mariko had married Mariko. Let's see, I was going to pick up these, The Wicked and the Divine, at one time. And then I saw the trade paper back up or the hardcover. It might be a good read. Because the first few books I did read, and it didn't seem kind of cool. I love the when they do a more immortality characters just to see how long they've lived and different things that they come up with with the story that's cool Warblade I like his artwork um, uh, is it Scott Clark? I like his artwork that's cool Weird World Weapon X different this started off kind of like it just I, just I didn't couldn't get into it we, we only found them when they did it it was a cool premise a cool idea but the writing wasn't well done this is cool I'll set this over here I'm almost done with just this side okay walking to look seven bucks 105 107, 105, 112, 113, 111, 100, $7, 100, first appearance in Egan, 101, 101, these are going for a little bit more money, Ten bucks there. Some man Logan. That's a cool cover. There's Wonder Woman. Okay. Oh. Zombies. X Force. Let me pick up, oh, I don't want to mess up, oh gosh. Let me 
pick up a few of the um, Walking Dead's, I'm not sure. X-Men. I get through these a little faster here. I gotta stop this, because it, once it gets past um, 30 minutes, it, it'll cut off. So, just to, I wanted you to see a little bit what I'm looking at. In case I see something really cool, I'll try to do another video. I always like the, the Dave Finch Ultimate x men I always like his artwork on these. Spider-Man. Okay, that's it about all this. So, but thank you for watching. Uh, let me know what you think about the books and everything. I haven't done one of these in a while. I like doing these. Well, you guys have a great day, and Collector Dude is out. I'm going to go through this stuff here. All right. That's really cool, too.